I'm going to show you a really quick way of how to find out how many pages of your website is indexed by Google without using any fancy tools. First off, a few quick basics. What is indexing? Well, when it comes to search engine indexing, it refers to the collection, parsing, and storing of data in order to facilitate fast and accurate results. Hmm. Well, that is a lot of words. What does that really mean? Basically, it means how the search engines check the content of your website and display it as a result if they find it relevant. You've probably seen when doing searches online that the search engines show how many results were displayed and how quickly they were displayed. Now, it's always really fast because they organize the data before you even make the search. Pretty clever. But why should you care about indexing? Quite simply, if you run a small business and you have a website which is poorly indexed or worse still, not indexed at all, if someone does a search relevant to your business, you are not going to show up in the search results. So you'll be losing out on visits, therefore you will be losing out on business. And that is why you should care. I'm not gonna harp on about it anymore. I'm gonna go ahead and show you this quick check. It's really very simple and this is how it's done. So head on over to Google. This works in Yahoo as well. You type in site colon and then the URL that you want to check. Do a search. You'll see that there's quite a few results for youtube.com as you'd expect. Uh, more importantly, that all the results are pages from the youtube.com domain. So that's what you want to see for your site. Now, this will work on all domains. Not as many results as YouTube, but uh, there you go. Uh, basically, what you're looking for is the amount of pages that you have on your website to match the results that are shown. So if you're doing this test and you're seeing that it matches or it's, it's kind of close, then that's good. If not, that's not so good. But that's basically the uh, the check is site colon, and then the URL just in your uh, in your browser using Google. Okay, hang on. What if you did this check and you got zero results? Mm. Well, don't fret just yet. Make sure you did the check exactly as the example. So. Don't use www, you lose that on all the subdomains, and also some domains um, are registered without that. So make sure you just start off straight at the HTTP and then go straight into uh, the domain, exactly as I showed you in the example. If you've done that and you're still getting zero results or far fewer results than you would expect, then you really need to contact the person or company that's looking after and managing your website and tell them, oi, this is not good enough, sort it out. Good luck. Well, I really hope you found that useful and I hope that you found uh, your site fully indexed when you did the check as well. It would be fantastic uh, if you would subscribe, I always point there, uh, somewhere around there, there's a massive subscribe button um, click it, that would be ace. Um, and if you have any comments or questions, you can leave them below this video or you can go on to bantamdigital.com and leave a message there. Thank you so much for watching.